Welcome, everybody. We'll start some questions now. Thank you for joining us here today, guys. After months of speculation, the deal is finally done and we're just minutes away from seeing his debut. Can he live up to the hype? Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon. And there are a few more enjoyable days on the football calendar than opening day in the Premier League. It is Manchester United up against Newcastle United. Well, thank you, Derek. Brilliant atmosphere here today. All that hard slog in pre-season. All aimed for this game. First game of the season. All that preparation is for this. It's for this 90 minutes. Focus on it. Get the three points. Move on to the next one. Looking forward to it. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. And a goal! They start! as they mean to continue they make the opening statement so the match has restarted 1-0 here Well, a significant reorganisation within the football club and a new manager in place. Lee, what sort of impact are you expecting from him? Well, it's a big change and they'll absolutely expect him to... And up for grabs off the keeper. And he's clear his lines. Bruno Fernandes. Shaw. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. And he read it well. Rice. Chance here. A stellar piece of defending. Almiron. Joel Linton. Hayden. Miguel Almiron. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Donny van der Beek. Bruno Fernandes. Intelligent threaded pass here. And now can he keep calm? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. It's going their way. 2-0. Goal for Manchester United. seven. Cristiano. Miguel Almiron, Longstaff, Emil Kraft, it's with Joe Linton, a 
danger here as he runs at them. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? It might be on for them. Real chance. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do it justice how patient they were in the build-up, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. So there we have it, 2-1. Really showing off his wide range of passing skills. And he's in. It's up and up for him. And thumped away. Hayden. It's with Joe Linton. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Callum Wilson. Poor pass. Applying vigorous pressure. Chance to finish. Cutting the ball back. Excellent block. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, they've jumped in front, Lee. That's the most important thing. Your assessment so far? It's been a decent half for United. The coach still has some work to do at half-time, though ball retention has to improve a little bit in the second half if they're going to dominate possession could be key can they get in behind them gives it a go oh and it goes now they're level who saw this coming incredible Marcus Rashford in position. Well, not the best clearance. Rashford, wonderful block. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, it was a fantastic first half performance by Cristiano Ronaldo. No doubt about that, Lee. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Well, you've got to savour such moments. Emil Kraft. Kieran Clark. Callum Wilson. Well, there's been quite a bit of interest in Everton's new acquisition, finally confirmed, Lee. Well, Derek, the fans are really going to love him. He's a top player, a real pro. In fact, he's a manager's dream. Van der Beek. Sancho. And he's made headway. And he clears it out of harm's way. Good pressure high up the pitch. Van der Beek, Sancho. It was well stopped. Well, the positioning is everything for a goalkeeper, and he was in a good position then. Hayden. Joel Linton. Wilson with it. Mohamed Madi Kamara. Almiron. Well, based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. I'm hearing.
morning there's been a not an awful lot wrong with that free kick but just wide when you set up for a free kick you have to hit the target He wasn't far off, but it was a miss. Apologies for interrupting Alan McAnally. To confirm, Wolves did find the net in that game, and their lead stands at 1-0 presently. Well, High-quality defending. I believe there's been a change to the scoreline in the Brentford match. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's a second goal for Leeds United. 68 minutes played, 2-1. Many thanks, Alan. Bruno Fernandes, Rice with it, now what can they do from here? Well that's a splendid piece of challenging, it might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack you know. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Offside quite clearly. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural break before administering the caution. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Physio's up on the touchline, keeping an eye on him as he went over on his angle. Looks like he's going to be OK. Well, the keeper had to concentrate. And Manchester United might be able to profit here. Corner it is. And time for the change now. The keeper was up to the task. Well, it's a decent effort, but the real opportunity goes begging there. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Couldn't keep it. Well, they're certainly thinking about a winner. Mason Greenwood. Well, they might be onto something. Oh, it was a close run thing, but the goalkeeper just got there first. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. Great pressure to win the ball back. Ronaldo! Well, body in the way. Ronaldo and how about that for reflex action perfect perfect goalkeeper he waited he waited then look at him spring and short it is and a long way out here and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save Manchester United know they've got to be precise with the corner given the circumstances a oh, tremendous block and he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. And there it is, the final whistle. The referee decides that...